Hey there, and welcome to another video with me. In this video, I'm going to show you how to import uh, data from your uh, Mac. You might be using an iMac or a, or a normal Mac. I use an iMac. That's, that's what I use, but it's the same thing. It's the same operating system. So you'll be importing. I'll show you how to import contact from your Mac to your Android device. I use a Samsung. It's pretty easy. Uh, we're going to need a cable, right? So this is uh, your charging port cable. So this is my charging port cable. We're going to need that. And you also need an app. So we're going to download an app. It's called Android File Transfer. Okay, before I go on my screen to walk you through the details, the first thing you need to do is you need to connect your phone to your, to your Mac, right? So do that now. And then I see you on my PC. Just connect your phone first, and then I see you on my PC to walk you through. Okay, guys, once you are on your screen, right, what you need to do is you need to go to Google or use any browser. So type, um, so on Google, you need to type Android File Transfer Mac, right? So you type that, and then you click on the first one, Android file transfer. So you need to download the app. So once you download the app, you now need to install the app on your PC, right? So that's what you have to do. So this is basically how the app looks like. Um, it's an easy and very pretty nice, nice app to use. Like I've connected my phone to my Mac, right? At the moment, it says here, can't access device storage. So you need to click here, okay, never mind. That's okay. So one, so what you need to do is you need to disconnect your cable again, right? And reconnect it. That's fine. Right? And then you need to click here on allow. So once you click there on allow, you need to uh, close that. So, so you close that and then you go back again to your app because you, like, you know, you go back to Launchpad and then you click on on Android file, file transfer. Okay, as you can see now, this is what it shows, right? This, Okay, this is what it is, right? So at the moment, these are the data on my phone, right? Uh, so this, these are the data on my card because I have an SD card. I also have an SD card on my, in my phone. Uh, so I need to click here on card to see what's inside. Okay, this is my SD card and I, I do have a lot of data in my SD card as well. So if I click here on, let's say camera, this is what I have. Uh, if I go to pictures, screenshots, for example. These are some of the videos that I have on screenshots. Um, let's say I want to import content from my screenshots, for example. Let's just use screenshots, right? If I want to import that to my desktop, I can just drag and drop that to my desktop, right? So this is, this is the content. So that's basically the content I've dragged that drop up on my desktop and so let's use this, the first the second one i drag and drop that one so it was telling me i've already so you can see i've pasted two items on my desktop right right just pay in mind if you use an sd card you need to select the, the the card option but if you only use a phone you make sure that you select the phone now let's say i want to uh, import videos into my phone right so i'll go to say for example i want to import video into into my phone what i will need to do is i'll first of all come back again and i need to select where i want to put the videos if i want to put the videos because sometimes you may not have the space on your phone you have space on your sd card so i have space on my sd card at times i have space in my phone it depends you need to check so check where you want to put your content so in this case I, I would like to put it on my sd card so i'll just select card and then i'll just so i would like to put my videos in my camera so that's where i want to put so i'll just drag and crop it there 
and and the video is 1.57 gigabyte so it's going to upload it and it's fast trust me this is this is like one of the fastest ways to do that okay it has now imported the video into my um into my phone let's say for example if i want to import like two videos together i can always do that so i can import two videos together let's say now for example i want to import these two videos i'll just drag and drop that's it and it's so it's just going to put um, import it into my phone so that's how you import contact from your mac to your to your angle device or you export it from your uh Angle device to your Mac. So it's pretty much easy, you know, with this app, it's pretty much straightforward. All you need to do is to download the app and then that's it. Okay, guys, thank you very much for watching. As you can see, it was very easy and straightforward. You know, it's not a difficult process. So all you need to do is to download the app, connect your device, um, follow the steps, you know, just grab and crop, that's it. And this is way fast compared to uh, using a PC because when I use a PC to do this, it takes me forever. So as you can see, it was very uh, straightforward. So guys, uh, hit the like button, right? Encourage this video to go further, right? Share this content with your mates, family members, and everyone. Uh, and thank you very much for watching the content. And I'll see you next time. Take care.